everybody and welcome to the podcast. What was that? <laughs> <laughs> welcome to Per Per Captain Podcast. <laughs> I'm joined again. Today I'm joined again by Per Per, my co host. Hello. And you probably, I, yeah, I probably have terrible audio because I'm using a different headset today. So last week. That's so. <laughs> It's all a learning experience. We're getting better at this. It'll get better as long as as it goes. Mm-hmm. Well, with our luck, it'll, the first episode turned out great, and it just gets stupider and stupider as we go on. That could possibly that. Wow, <laughs> words. That could happen, but you know, then it could make a lot of people laugh. Maybe you never know. Yeah, it could. But well, thank you for joining us on podcast number two. Last week we talked about Among Us. I think. Right? Yes. Yeah. So that wait, it hasn't even been a week since we recorded the first episode. It's been like four nope. or five days maybe. Yeah. Not a long time ago. <laughs> so today we will be rating candy if I pull up my notepad really quick. I well, I can use this notepad to rate candy. Alright, so on my list, I have Snickers. What do we rate that? Snickers. That's the one where it has caramel in it, right? Yes. Where it has, like, the caramel, the chocolate, and the cracker cookie thing? Uh, hmm. I'd rate that, like, a 7 or an 8. So, I have a list here of 1, 2, 3. We'll put, uh, the... Since there's only the two of us, the candy that we both agree on is where we put the best one in number one is what it says. You said a seven yeah. or an eight? Yeah. So I'll put Snickers in seven. Goo Goo Cluster. What? What's that? I don't know, so I'll make a category uh, trash, I guess. <laughs> yeah, we'll say it's trash because we don't know what it is. That's how logic works. <laughs> now I'm just thinking, how am I going to add in my little picture of the notepad when we're done? <laughs> Magic of the power of editing. <laughs> Alright, I'll do candies that we know. Uh, Almond Joy. That's Wait, the- doesn't that one have coconut in it? Yes, coconut and almond. I, I rate it a zero. I don't like coconut, though. So, I like it, you don't. We'll put it in number 11. That's right above trash. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I just said all those. All those. There we go. Gummy bears. Ooh. We have some really good gummy bears. They're like the best gummy bears I've ever eaten. Mm-hmm. I'll say... Like an eight or a nine. Closer to nine. Yeah, probably nine. I like them, but I don't like them that much. Yeah. A Twix. All these candies, I don't remember what they taste like. <laughs> Which one? Twix is a caramel ish candy with crunches in it, I think. Ah. Uh. I'll say a seven or an eight. Well, we'll put it in category eight, I guess. <laughs> well, I just spelled Twix backwards. Darn it. <laughs> How'd you do that? I don't know. All right, so the next candy, Kit Kat. I love Kit Kat. I don't know if I've ever eaten a Kit Kat before. <gasps> I dare you. <laughs> I. I don't. I haven't really eaten that much candy, besides gummy bears. But you know, I don't eat a lot of candy like I used to. Yeah. So you don't know what Kit Kat is like. I put- well, can you explain what's in it? I'm guessing chocolate. Kit Kat is like a chocolate wafer. So it's nice. Ooh. And covered in chocolate, like the little. Uh, what am I thinking of? Little Debbie's. Uh, 
wafer crunch bar thing? Yeah. That sounds amazing. It's basically that, but covered in chocolate. Oh. Mm -hmm. That sounds so good. <laughs> oh, let's go put that in number six then. Or yeah. What do you that sounds good. I think that sounds like um that sounds like a good place to put it. Alrighty. For anyone on the podcast listening, uh we're new to this. We're we're not even adults yet, I'll just say that. So uh, don't judge us for being terrible judges of candy. Also, I d we don't really eat that much candy, so we don't know like all of the v wide variety of candies that are out there. Yeah. No. No Skittles? <laughs> I don't like Skittles. I hear you. I like Skittles. <laughs> I, I don't like the fruity taste and that they're kind of chewy and stuff. I like M&M's better. I don't see M&M's on the list yet. So I guess we'll put Skittles in 11 because I like them, you don't. Kind of like the Almond Joy. We could put it a little higher, cause I I can I could eat them. I just wouldn't enjoy it. But like with the coconut, the almond joy, I wouldn't even eat it. So number ten. Yeah. Alrighty. So <laughs> there you go. All right, uh, milk duds. I hate milk duds. They're not that bad. I'd eat them better. Um, I I'd, I'd eat them more than Skittles, but I don't really like them that much. So it's probably a ten, maybe. Yeah. Alrighty. Uh, let's see. Milk duds. I just spelled milk milk doodas. <laughs> All right, Charleston three at two. What is a Charleston three? I don't know. Sounds like a sneeze. <laughs> hey, you want some Charleston shrimp? <laughs> <laughs> exactly. How do you even spell it? All right. There we go. Charleston Chew. I was trying to spell it for the track. <laughs> Boom. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All right. A uh, candy bar called a Big Hunk. So is I don't know what the. Is it like it <laughs> it sounds like it would have chocolate on it for some reason. I don't know why. Just because most cho most candy bars do have chocolate. Yeah, I th right. Most of them do. Yeah. Uh, I'll put that in maybe eleven because it does have a chocolate in it that I know of. Yeah, chocolate's good. <laughs> yeah, Baby Ruth. We uh, we should know this. It sounds familiar, but I can't think of it. Baby Ruth is a chocolate. It's a kind of like a chewy kind of chocolate in the middle, but it's got some nuts, or I think it's peanuts around the outside, coated in chocolate. Ooh, mm -hmm. that sounds good. Yeah, the, that's pretty good. I I think they they deserve a nine. What about you? That sounds like a good place. Chico sticks. What? What is a Chico stick? I have no idea. It's it's been made since 1950 and it is made of peanut butter. Oh. Here we go. Darn it, Ellen, I need my spoonful first. It's made primarily of peanut butter, sugar, corn syrup, and toasted coconut. Oh. <laughs> That that was sounding good till the coconut. <laughs> that lost your vote. <laughs> yeah. I don't really. I was gonna say, I was gonna say, ooh, peanut butter. That should go, you know, like nine ish. But since there's coconut, no. <laughs> I don't really like peanut buttery candies that much, but it's sounding good till I say coconut. Coconut. Yeah. Coconut and peanut butter shouldn't go together. <laughs> no. <laughs> Milky Way. Hmm. I'll click 
actual Milky Way. I don't remember what it's made of. I feel safe over there, though. Chocolate. And, uh... It's a chocolate-covered confectionery bar. Sold, it's sold as Three Musketeers. It's the Milky Way. But it's in the U.S. and Canada. That doesn't tell me what it's... <laughs> yeah, that, that doesn't explain what it's made of. I think it's made with a blob of chocolate. Well, chocolate is delicious, so... Alrighty, so... Uh, a number eight, maybe? But we haven't put anything in five, four, three, two, or one. We haven't found the truly good stuff yet. <laughs> so I guess I'll put them in six, maybe, because they're, they're pretty good. Yeah. All right, Jolly Ranchers. This is a classic. That's those are fruit flavored, right? Yeah, they're the little uh, hard. They're hard candies, but they're fruit flavored. Hmm. You most of the time you just suck on them until they turn into a itty bitty tiny thing, then you eat the last bit of it. They're really good. Yeah. I could eat. Yeah, those sound good. Should we, uh, uh, cause it's a hard, it's, I think it's the first hard candy we've had. Yeah, I think so. Cause, cause Skittles aren't really hard, they're kind of chewy. So should we put it at five? Because I like hard candy a lot. Yeah. Or we can even put it at four if you want. Eh, I'd say five. Right. Cause fruit flavored candy really isn't my most favorite. That's nerve-wracking. Oh, here's, here's what it is. It's a caramel substance. It, in the shape of a tube or something, it's got cream inside of it. Caramel and cream stretched out like a tube, so... Cow turds. <laughs> uh, I'll pass. <laughs> yeah, that doesn't sound very good. <laughs> Welcome to the trash pile, cow turds candy. <laughs> That's a pretty name, but I don't know about or anything about the candy. One of the Google searches is, what, is, what drug is Mary Jane? <laughs> it's called sugar. <laughs> candy. Mary Jane is a peanut butter and molasses flavored taffy candy. So it's a taffy. I don't really like taffy. Join the big pumpkin home from school. <laughs> yeah, they need company. <laughs> right, so now we have dots. Dots <sighs> is they're gumdrops, basically. It's a oh, sorry. <laughs> you saying dots made me think of something. Um, oh. we had when. What, that I had a long time ago when I was little called Dippin' Dots, I think. Huh? It's like ice cream, like little uh, dots of ice cream, and it's so good. Mm -hmm. Anyway, what were we talking about? <laughs> For rating candy, uh, the Dots candy. It's a made by the Tootsie Roll Company. It's Ooh. Gumdrops. They're basically gumdrops. So I'd eat that. <laughs> what would you rate uh, gumdrops? Hmm. We could do like um a seven or an eight. Maybe they can. I guess they can join the eight because all we have on eight is the six. Yeah. So I just write gumdrops. Well then, uh, if I can find my list again, we have M and M's. Yeah. I vote to give these a one. <laughs> yes. They come in so many different types where you can have like peanuts in them. I think there's coffee ones. They're just, it's a giant variety of them and they're so good. I've come across a problem. Huh. I cannot find the and symbol on my keyboard. <laughs> oh, there it is. It's on seven. M and M. Yeah. All right. Next we have candy corn. 
Oh. <laughs> so the thing about candy corn is I don't really like the taste of it, but eating it gives me like a lot of um, nostalgia for, you know, the past and stuff. So I really like them. Oh. Some of them are hard. Yeah. Some of them are soft. So what would we rate I like the softer ones. Yeah, I like the softer ones. What would you rate it? How about, um, how much do you like them? Let's put it at a two or a three. I'll put it in a three. To make it a bit fair, I guess. Yeah. Candy. That just spelled collapse. <laughs> Candy corn. There we go. All right. Fun dip. What's that? A uh, fun dip is made by the Will Willy Wonka Chocolate Company. That's actually a thing, apparently. Yeah. It's a, a little pack of flavored sugar, and you have a little uh, stick, hard candy stick that's made of sugar, but you lick it, I think, and you dip So it's practically just a little thing of sugar? Yeah, but it's like a little sugar stick that you dip into a pack of, pack of powdered sugar that you just eat it. So they no. I don't- that doesn't sound good. <laughs> it's not all that bad, but yeah. <laughs> What do you think it was the rating of? Mm, uh, the lowest is 11, right? Yeah. Uh, no, trash is the lowest. I think it would be either in the trash or at 11. <laughs> okay. Well, they're not Cause, trash, Maybe 11? Yeah, because from how I see it, who just wants to sit there and eat a pack of sugar while holding off of something that is also only sugar, so. Well, <laughs> I've eaten them before, so guilty as charged. <laughs> Here we go, Airheads. Ooh! These are pretty I've wanted... Yeah, I haven't... I don't think I've ever eaten them, but I want to. And also, sour is just really fun. <laughs> so big you fly. Yeah, I get com I get um commercials for that all the time. <laughs> all right. So, uh, what do you want to rate these? I would say the top five, somewhere in the top five. So number four. Yeah, that sounds good. Alrighty, uh, mounds, a coconut candy. No. <laughs> That sounds kind of good, but no coconut. <laughs> it's got coconut in it, so I'm I'm not I don't like it. So we'll put it in trash. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know what it is with the almond joy. It has coconut, but I like co I like it if it's the almond joy though. All right next. Yeah. Is Sour Patch Kids. Sour Patch Kids. These are. Eh. I just ate my first pack of Sour Patch Kids the other day. They're not that bad. I've never had them. Oh. Well, they're uh, basically like a, just, what, uh, a gummy, but they're super sour. Yeah. But it's like a sa more sour than a lemon. <laughs> to make your lips and your eyes pop out of your face. That seems painful. Let's put it, um, we could also put it at four. Oh, okay. <laughs> Have both of the sh sour candy with each other. <laughs> Eventually, we need to do a IRL podcast and try candy. <laughs> Make people can watch our eyes pop out of our heads. I think my my face would fall off from all the sugar. <laughs> I would think you'd be laughing too much. Uh, I don't know. Sometimes sugar makes me sleepy. Yeah, those are good. Yeah, you want to rate them a two or like a five or something? Well, do you like them? I love them. What do you want to rate them? Let's rate them a two then. Okay. Because they're not quite as good as M&M's, but they're still very good. Mm -hmm. 
as soon as I can figure out how to start seeing it. I just want to say for the audience, I did get this idea of braiding candy from a YouTube named I Am Wildcat Goes Podcast, so I'm not trying to copy him. I just thought it'd be something fun for me to do with my friends. Yeah. All right, the next candy is Butterfingers. Do you know what a Butterfinger is, right? Yeah, but I don't remember what's in it. Hey guys, Canton Figure here. And I just want to pop in right quick to explain what exactly happened. So you will, no you will notice that the podcast, it, all the audio suddenly cuts off and you hear like a staticky thunk. And you s hear the beginning of a Windows error or something. That would be because as I was moving around while recording the podcast, I accidentally unplugged my headset. And while I was editing, I realized that I got the audio for Purper back. So you can still hear her during the podcast, but you cannot hear my voice. So, unfortunately, I have to scrap half the podcast. But I want to say we did have a lot of fun. Uh, it, I am very... It's very unfortunate that uh, we can't get my audio back. I'll have to start recording my audio on a separate track, possibly. But I just wanted to let you guys know what exactly happened. And I have a list of the candies we raided, since you never got, you will never get to find out what exactly happened on the podcast unless I read to you. So in category one, we have M Ms, Kisses, and Bubble. And we're ranking these from 1 to 10, 1 to 11 in trash. 1 it one is the best in ranking down. In rank 2, we have Reese's, Peanut Butter Cups, and Hershey's. Rank uh, Category 3, we have Candy Corn and Smarties. Category 4, we have Airheads, Sour Patch Kids. Category 5, we have Jolly Ranchers, Butterfingers, Twizzlers. In Category 6, we have Kit Kats, Milky Ways, Reese's Pieces, and Crunch Bars. In category seven, the only some, somehow it's the only one in number seven, Snickers. In category eight, we have gumdrops and Twix. Category nine, we have gummy bears and Lady Rue. Category ten, we have Skittles and Milk Duds. Category eleven, Almond Joy, Big Hunk, Mary Jane, Fun Dip, Cotton Candy. And in the trash category, we have Goo Goo Cluster. Charleston Chew, Chico Stick, Cow Tails, and Mal. So yeah, guys, I just wanted to let you guys know what exactly happened. Um, I apologize for this. I was not expecting my audio to not come back. It makes no sense how uh, Purper's audio, her audio basically never changed. You could still hear, hear her just fine. But somehow when I plugged my headset back in, I either would have had to restart the recording or reset or restart my NVIDIA software, or some, I would have had to do something different than what I did than just plug it back up and make sure I had everything set up. So once again, I apologize for cutting the podcast in half. Quite literally, this is you're only getting half the podcast. But uh, hopefully, Lord willing, we will have episode three will be maybe an hour long, and if possible, we'll have a special guest. Thank you guys for tuning in, and hopefully Podcast 3 will be better.